Let's consider this computer program and its runtime. Let's look to the first line of the program. We can see we're creating an integer variable that stores 7. More accurately, we can say this is a name that's bound to an object that has the value of 7. This program statement will actually print the content of my underscore integer to here, as you can see in the runtime. This program statement will now execute, and it will print the type of my integer. And the output can be seen here. This tells us we're dealing with an integer. That is, the type of the object is an integer. Now, this program statement will print the ID of my underscore integer. And the ID can be seen here. Now, this is the ID of the object, which is the address of the object in memory. This is the model that shows the state of affairs after this is executed, where this is the value, the type, and the ID.